If there's anything my team or I can do to assist, please do not hesitate to reach out to any of us. Um, while I have a captive audience, um, I'd like to highlight the webinar series we have scheduled for the next several weeks. Um, our goal here was to bring you up-to-date information from our properties in a focused manner. Uh, we began the series with our domestic properties and options and have added additional webinars to cover exciting international destinations. If you'd like to be added to our webinar mailing list, please send me a uh, request via email. And should you have any suggestions for a topic or if there's a particular region of the world that you're most interested in, I'd love to hear that feedback. Please email me those details. All right. Now, so for some of you that are not familiar, our um, chain code is LX. And if not already doing so, I'd like to encourage you to utilize our VIP desk. This is a team that's spread across the globe, uh, speaking over nine different languages collectively. They can uh, obtain quotes, make reservations, handle VIP requests, and much more. Additionally, some of you have pointed out that our travel agent portal is down. That is correct. We're updating the portal currently and hope to have this back up in the coming weeks. In addition, we hope to have a uh, travel agent um, page uh, where all the webinars that we have in our featuring uh, will be listed for you to register. Uh, as well as any recorded sessions will be available uh, on our YouTube channel, which is SLH Agents, if you'd like to search. Now, before we begin, if not presenting, I'd like to ask you to ensure your uh, phone is muted uh, so there's no background noise. Agents, for any questions you have for myself or my SLH hoteliers, please uh, type those into the chat box. I will ensure each question is answered before the end of the webinar. And please note, your time is extremely valuable to me. And as such, each presenter is given an opportunity to practice before today's webinar. In the unlikely event there isn't a technical difficulty, a follow-up will be sent for any missed portions uh, or any missed property information. And most importantly, I'll ensure we keep moving things along. Now, with that, I'd like to introduce you to our Italy City Center hotels today. We have uh, Salvatore uh, from Hotel Byron, uh, Casa Greta Hotel with Alina, Hotel Splendid Royale with Francesca, and last but not least, Hotel Regency with Francesca. Uh, with that, I'd like to ask uh, Mr. Salvatore if he would go ahead and unmute himself and share his screen. Okay, Josh? Yes, sir, you're perfect. Okay. Shall I start? You can begin. Fantastic. So, um, hi everybody. I'm Salvatore Madonna, the owner of the Hotel Byron in Forte de Marmi. Uh, we are based in the northwest part of Tuscany, right on the seaside. Uh, we are uh, just uh, half an hour from Pisa Airport, so that would be the closest airport for us, and only one hour from uh, uh, Florence Airport. So, uh, clients can have uh, both these chances, and you can also combine Forte Remami as one of the top leisure destinations in Italy with Florence, if you have clients moving around Italy and they want some uh, uh, break after uh, no, big cities or uh, a wonderful city as Florence. When they're asking you uh, um, a beach uh, resort, uh, Forte Remami can be an ideal choice, an opportunity to, to let them experience a truly Italian destination without going further south uh, to the Amalfi Coast that we take for sure it's wonderful but it takes more time once you are uh, in the middle part of uh, of italy we are also close to Lucca, that is a lovely ancient city out of the mass of tourism and as well not far away from the cinque terre the beautiful things that we can offer to all our clients is a private boat that will uh, give them the chance to avoid all the traffic uh, from the cinque terre so this is a, an incredible opportunity um either at the beginning of the season or in uh, summertime so they can have uh, uh, the chance to see the Cinque Terre in a different way. We are also close to Pietra Santa, a wonderful medieval city, a uh, village where uh, many artists are working because uh, right behind us we have uh, the, um, the marble quarries. We, in fact, we have all the opportunity to offer a marble safari, seeing all the different uh, opportunity uh, from the, the quarries to see the landscape and how can, can we take the, the marble from uh, uh, our mountains. Uh, many other opportunities as well of, uh, with uh, food and wines. We are in Tuscany, so we are 45 minutes uh, from us. We have the truffle hunting opportunity in San Mignato. Olive oil experience, collecting olive oil around Luca, that is one of the most famous places where come 
uh, this uh, this wonderful product of nature, nature as well of uh, wine tasting and the opportunity of giving to your clients uh, uh, the chance to get in some of the best uh, um, uh, uh, vineyard estates where usually they are not open to clients, but we will give uh, them the opportunity uh, to visit them, such as uh, Sasikai or Nelaya, where the Super Tuscan ones are made. Uh, so these are just some ideas of uh, uh, half a day or a day uh, just around us. This is the Byron. So we are the only five-star hotels in Fort Remami. As I told you, Fort Remami is a very well-known um, hip destination in Italy, as well as Portofino, Capri. Uh, for me, the, the main difference is really that uh, it's uh, here, the majority are Italians. So for foreigners coming, they can have a, a 360 degrees uh, experience about an Italian uh, destination. We just finished our total renovation last year, April uh, 19, and we had this wonderful penthouse and we restyled all the common areas and as well, uh, all the rooms are brand, brand new. As you can see from here, we are the only five-star uh, hotel in front of the seaside. Behind us, we have the Apuane Mountains. On top, you can see here, it's uh, marble. Uh, so we joined two villas of the last century, the first villa built in Fort Hermami in 1892, and we have converted in a five-star deluxe property. Uh, we have just 29 rooms, so it's really a boutique hotel where we can provide a tailor-made opportunity and service for all of our clients. This is just a shot from the, uh, from the back so that you can see how close we are to the to the beach. The beach is sandy, totally flat, so really suitable for families. Uh, here we have our uh, brand new restaurant, the Magnolia, that has one star Michelin, inside restaurant, and the rest of the rooms all surrounded by gardens in a very lovely and calm atmosphere. It's more like atmosphere of a private house where clients get together as friends than a, a standard hotel. Uh, the only room that we had under the renovation is the penthouse, uh, the biggest uh, and uh, the nicest room right now in Fort Remani. We are talking about 130 square meters, designed just for two, also connected with a, a, a superior suite with this huge terrace overlooking the seaside, where we can also bring our uh, Michelin star uh, chef to cook uh, in exclusivity for clients, for a, a dinner under the stars or a little party in total exclusivity. Um, we also have uh, some very interesting suite as the family suite where we can keep uh, eight people together on two floors with uh, four different rooms, two bathrooms, two different entrance. Uh, our suite mainly are bi-level or uh, two bedroom in order to have an entire, always an entire family, but giving the chance to the parents not to share the same uh, space uh, with the kids. All the other rooms are divided in six other different categories. All of them are different for color, measure, view. Some of them are as a balcony. Some of them are facing directly the seaside. So it's up to you to ask uh, as many things as possible because we um, we are not asking about any supplement. So the first word is asking as the first will be served. Um, so all the rooms, as I told you, are these bright colors and with this contemporary style that for us is something really beautiful. And last but not least, our restaurant La Magnolia that can really provide a fine dining experience with our chef Cristofano Trapani. Uh, the kind of cuisine that we offer is uh, uh, gourmet cuisine, but not that crazy stuff with foam and crazy things, uh, but more co consistency, something that it's more for, for us and for me, more connected to a seaside, uh, very nice leisure destination. So this is the setup that we offer to all our clients every time, every day. And these are some images of the beautiful things that uh, Cristoforo can uh, offer for them. So this can be a, really an ideal choice for to use the hotel as a base and to move around or just to do a typical lazy Italian vacation, having fun. Shopping is terrific. They, you can find here in Forte de Marmi the best Italian shops and European. So the most important uh, label, they have their own boutique in town. I think uh, just I've done my presentation. Are right, fantastic. That's great. Thank you so much. Yeah. Um, and now we'll move on to Cas Segreto. So if you would just unmute yourself and share your screen. There we go. Lana, let me just unmute you so we can hear you. There okay. we go. Yes, ma'am. And we're we're viewing your uh, WebEx screen right now. Just bear with us. Uh, 
uh, we're having Ilana, we're having some feedback. I'm going to mute you right now and um, and we'll see if we can get this corrected. Um, and we're going to go to Hotel Splendid Royale. Francesca. Hi. Hello. Hello. Would you share your screen, please? Yes. I see it. Um, are we going on with the with me or with Delenia? Because I now I no. see that Delenia is no. sharing. No, it's and I think I'm having the yeah. She's having some okay. glitches. Yeah. I'm gonna mute Ilana and, and you can you can start Francesca. Thank you everyone for bearing with us. Yeah. <laughs> a moment. Can you can you see the presentation? Not yet. We see uh -huh. um, Ilana's desktop, which is fine. Ah. But you just you, all you have to do is share your screen now. Yeah. I feel like I should have some. Kind I'm of so sorry. <laughs> Perfect. We're getting closer, Francesca. We can see your desktop. I'm really, I'm, no, I'm really sorry. Let's try again. All right, perfection. Thank you, my dear. Can you see it? Perfection. Thank you. Okay, so welcome to Roma. As you can see, I'm sitting on our last floor where Mirabel, our restaurant is. And on, the, on my back, maybe you saw the view and we will talk later. Obviously, your safety, your guest safety is our safety and vice versa. So we are ready with all the protocol of PPE for international and Italian rooms. Roma always gives you an occasion to come back, some postcard from our beautiful city. We are very lucky to live here. Where Splendid Royale is? We are located five minutes walking to the Spanish Steps and five minutes walking from Via Veneto. As you can see on my back, you can also recognize St. Peter's. The, the hotel will, um, have the 20th anniversary uh, next year. It's a proud member of SLH from since years, and we are part of the WIN program. The Hotel Splendid Real is still a classical hotel, even if we are renovating uh, in this period, we decided to anticipate uh, due to the COVID problem, the, the COVID era, uh, we anticipate the renovation. So we are making new the lobby, and that's, the work in progress that we are finishing for uh, the beginning of July. We are going to reopen probably on September where all the hotel, including the majority of the existing wing will be renovated and we are going to open a new wing, which I will show you. That's the way people feel at our hotel. It's, uh, there are pictures taken from our guests. They tag themselves in our hotel and we love to use it to show you how they feel in the atmosphere of our hotel. That's uh, the existing part. We have been renovating all the bathrooms and the majority of the rooms in this uh, period. And uh, we will be back new on September. That's another way to leave our rooms and how people really feel that they're easy at, at home at us and how they enjoy our terraces with an amazing view that we are so lucky to have. We have Villa Borghese Garden and, and Roma. Different solution for families. We can also uh, talk about buyout and also to reserve an entire floor for families as you wish. And as soon your guests will wake up at us, they have a great cappuccino with an amazing view, just one floor down where I'm sitting now which is, that was before COVID, BC, and now we are going to take new pictures with the new distancing. We, we need obviously to take table with different, uh, um, they cannot be so close as it used to be. 
that was our team. It's still our team, but there was a picture taken before COVID and when we won an award on December to be the best uh, restaurant in Rome and the best uh, panoramic restaurant. Again, we use this picture to show you how people can really uh, enjoy our view. They are living uh, their experience in our restaurant here at Mirabel with Borga Villa Borghese Gardens and Roma uh, under their feet. Again, new Eastern moments, how people really feel at us and they really enjoy our atmosphere. That was a picture taken that we used to use in our presentation before COVID. We are going to have a new one because we are going to renovate the restaurant. The restaurant will be opening the 1st of July. Everything will be new, obviously with new also tasting menu, but the view of the atmosphere will be always the same. Can you see the terrace? It's one of the most famous in Rome to book your guests. Even if they are not choosing us to stay at our hotel, we have a lot of uh, people that know knows us and reserve their table for last dinner in Rome. Our chef, it's an Italian chef, and a cab privé. They can taste, taste up to 700 wine labels in total privacy. And that's the new wing. So we will match the classical style adding 16 new rooms and suites. Also, this new wing can be uh, sold as a buyout, if you wish, and will be completely different style, contemporary style. So your guests can have different tastes and we have the solution. We can um, privatize each floor for families. We will have just four floors on this new wing. And as you can see, it's brighter, we have lights, we have obviously large spaces, and the bathroom really, it's an experience on the farm trip that we had in the past, in the, before the lockdown. Really, we have, we collect a lot of great comments uh, about uh, the, large, the largest and how it's comfortable to be there. So we wait for you in Roma. Arrivederci and thanks for coming to this webinar. Thank you, Francesca. I really appreciate that. I'm going to mute you now. You can leave your screen as is. Um, Ilana, um, I'm, I've just unmuted you. Uh, let's go ahead and try sharing your screen uh, again. See if we have any issues. Damn, I knew it would work. Can you, <laughs> can you hear me now? We can hear you. Um, just okay. um, speak probably a little bit slower. You're a little choppy. OK. I'll let you know that. Good. You can you can start. I can start. Venice, I know that all of you are looking for Venice. And here we are. Um, the hotel is actually open. Um, we have opened last weekend and all the COVID protocols are already in place. And fortunately, we don't have any uh, problems so far to to uh, be able to accommodate all the um, new regulation and new protocols that have been placed uh, for the hotel to welcome the guests. Uh, Casa Gredo has 6,000 square meters of open space, so we didn't really have to change anything of the structure of the palace. Uh, Location-wise, we are next to Rialto Bridge, approximately 15 minutes walking to St. Mark's Square. We have our own private pay for water taxis and the gondola that stops right in the main entrance of the hotel. Here you see some Mark. So we are next to some Mark, but we're not in the crowded of some Mark. And this is the palace from the inside. Casa Greta is a 15th century palace. It's been declared a national monument and is actually a museum. So everything inside the palace is original. And what is not original is a reproduction of what it was in the past. My personal opinion is the real Venetian experience. It's what people expect when it comes to Venice. 32 rooms, and each room is completely different to the other one. We do have standard junior suite and suite facing the back of the hotel, which are more um, like historical kind of room, and standard junior suite and suite facing the Grand Canal, which are a bit more contemporary in style, uh, because have they, those are the rooms that have been created when the palace turned into a proper hotel. 
price wise uh, our entry level uh, goes from 250 euros in low season up to 550 in uh, in high season the restaurant on the ground floor with an amazing terrace overlooking the canal which is open lunch and dinner and our new rooftop terra, which has just been nominated at the, among the 20th best terraces in Italy. So everybody are actually welcome to come. Uh, this year, this summer, we only open it on Friday and Saturday. But from the next season, the terrace will be open um, to all the weekend, all week uh, from March till October. And here we are. Awesome. Thank you so much. This is fantastic. All right. So now you can go ahead and mute yourself and we will take it over to Hotel Regency. Francesco, if you'd like to unmute yourself and share your screen, sir. I just unmuted you, actually. Okay. Thank you. Perfection. Thank you, everyone, for being here. I am Francesco. Uh, I'm really happy to be part of this webinar today and i'm thrilled to announce that we'll reopen our doors on uh, august 22nd uh during this we have closed in march as everyone uh we took advantage of this period to complete some of the renovation works we had planned some others have been uh, postponed to next year unfortunately but due, due to this situation we had to uh take some uh, uh make some decisions that uh, brought us to, to this unfortunately so regency is a uh it's a florentine villa of the 19th century uh and it has reopened in uh, 1960 so 60 years ago as a five-star luxury hotel uh the idea that the owners as i've always uh, transmitted us is to make it be like a true home away from home and it's, this is a common saying that is often used, but for us, it's truly uh, our philosophy. During these years, uh, we have gone through several renovations, uh, you know, to, to maintain the beauty of the building and the indoors, and of course, enhance also the levels of comfort for our guests. Everything is uh, decorated inside with a very classical Florentine style, unique pieces of art uh, and unique furniture in all the common areas and the rooms. Here you can see some examples. Uh, you know, as I said, this is a boutique hotel, 31 rooms and suites, uh, a really nice restaurant with two different types of cuisine, good location and very close to the, uh, in a very elegant uh, neighborhood, very close to all the major attractions that Florence has and uh, a garden as well. We are actually the only SLH property in town that uh, features a garden. The suites, as I was mentioning, are all uh, been individually decorated in classical Florentine style. We have different types, of course, from classic to a penthouse suites, and rates can start from 200 to 150 in low season for a, a, an entry level, and go up in peak season, starting from 400, 450, and up. Uh, different, as I was mentioning before, different room types from classic to penthouse. We also have family solutions. Uh, to accommodate, you know, uh, groups up to five people, sorry, uh, parties of uh, up to five people in, in one room. So it's really, really convenient, good location, walking distance from all the major attractions that we have in, in town that are many, actually. Uh, we have, after this COVID uh, pandemic, we have redesigned and really organized our breakfast service before it was a buffet. Now is all, all carts served either in the garden, in the restaurant, or in the room, according to the guest needs. Uh, this is our restaurant, the main room, uh, main dining room. Uh, fortunately, we didn't have we, we didn't have to do many changes because uh, our tables are already quite spread. So people, even if this picture maybe doesn't uh, show it very well, uh, so the, our guests can really uh, be safe and feel safe when they come uh, to our restaurant. And we also have a garden outside where the space is even more. As I was mentioning before, different type of cuisine, a bistro open for lunch and dinner, and a gourmet fine dining menu at dinner uh, only. 
So to give a, a, a true uh, and complete experience, culinary experience of Florence. You know, one of the reasons why people travel to Italy is also I've mentioned before the garden is, uh, we like to define like a, a hidden oasis of peace. Guests here can just enjoy, you know, have a drink, uh, enjoy a meal, of course, read a book, or just, uh, you know, enjoy the Italian, uh, Italian and Tuscan sun, which is not bad. This is another view of our, of our garden, which is really lovely. We have completely redone it uh, last year. So now is, uh, this is the actual shape that it has. For this, uh, in response to uh, in response to the uh, what saying, uh, to the COVID measures, we we have decided to create more flexibility in our rate plans. So we now have uh, flexible rates with free cancellation up to three or thirty uh, days prior to arrival, uh, with discounts, of course. And for those who want to use the uh, usual. Uh, rate types we have also our prepaid and not refundable discounted rate which is very convenient actually and this was of course for the uh, flexibility part now speaking of safety we have uh, implemented a new uh, contactless check-in and check-out process uh, where you know guests can send us before the uh, their uh, documents registration before so when they arrive they just need to collect the key and go to their room uh, new uh, procedures of sanitization of all the common areas with uh, specific certified products, as well for the rooms, uh, recirculation of air and air as well, you know, certified suicidal products. So it's good for uh, our guests actually can feel safe when they are here. Uh, we have been uh, studying all the government measures, what the World Health uh, Organization was saying, and we also the uh, hotel uh, association in Italy to be prepared to to welcome back our guests that will start as I said before on August 22nd. Breakfast has been uh, reorganized as I mentioned before. So the position as I was mentioning very convenient elegant uh, neighborhood few steps from the city center and all the attractions. The Duomo is only 15 minutes the Ponte Vecchio in the shopping district, 20 minutes. So it's uh, the Galleria dell'Accademia where the Michelangelo David is, is only 15, 20 minutes as well. So uh, uh, 10 minutes actually, sorry. Uh, so it's very, very close, very convenient. We have a park in front of the property. So there's a green area where we can, uh, I guess, can enjoy. Just a three seconds to remind you that we also have a sister property in Rome, Hotel of Byron, still part of SLH, of course, same kind of hospitality, very, uh, home oriented. Uh, this is it. You know, I would like to thank you for your uh, attention. Uh, it was a pleasure uh, speaking to you today. Anything you need in Rome or Florence, feel free to reach out. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, Francesco. Uh, agents, if you have any questions, now's the time to ask. Place those into the chat box. I'll ensure that those are answered quickly. Um, otherwise, I want to thank my SLH hoteliers for taking the time to practice today and to uh, share uh, information on your properties with uh, the audience here. Uh, agents, thank you for taking the time out of your day to, to listen to um, our SLH fantastic properties. So if there's anything I can do to assist, have any questions, please pose those to me and I'll reach out to the hotels on your behalf. Thank you so much again. Have a great day, everyone. Bye-bye.